Welcome back to the Arctic Den. Today we are playing a first person horror game called Within. You get a call from someone, and things go wrong. They abandoned the god who had made them. They sacrificed unto demons whom they knew not. Deuteronomy 32, 15. I hadn't heard from my brother in over three months, which wasn't unusual. Nick tends to disappear for months at a time, not returning my calls, and then he surfaces again as if nothing had happened. Last night at around 3 a.m., he left a voice message. I heard it when I woke up a few hours later. Maya, I hope you're okay. I, I know I haven't been in touch, but I just wanted to let you know. Uh, you may not hear from me again for a while. Oh Don't dear. Don't want you to worry, though. I'm in a spot of trouble, but nothing I can't handle. I'll figure it out. Whatever you do, don't come looking for me. I'll call you when things are right. Alright, so we're in a decrepit apartment. Your brother's missing. Last thing you know is he called you. Telling you not to come look for him. Oh dear. Hello? Why are you guys fighting in there? I don't want to go in there at all. Oh, the lights are out. Great. Probably have to go down that hallway. Guess we're going down this hallway. Oh. Hello? Hello, hello. Shadow. I just want to be your friend. Huh. Where'd they go? There was someone just here. That's what you think. Clearly not. Guess we're going in here. Well, this is it. I should just ring the doorbell, see if he answers. Although, if he's been drinking, I don't have much hope. Ring, ring. Yep. Gonna keep clicking this doorbell. I guess he's either not home, or he's sleeping yep. off a drunken he binge. He is uh, definitely not there. Which would not be entirely surprising. Maybe I should just try to open the door and let myself in. Oh yeah. Let's totally go into a creepy apartment who nobody's answered. Gosh, what is that smell? Oh, There's dear. gotta be a light switch somewhere. Nick? Hello? Nick, are you here? Oh, this place is disgusting. How is he living like this? This is terrible. Muzelli and fruit. That sounds like a really disgusting brand of pizza. Do not open. Go back. Yeah, I'm totally gonna open that door. Didn't know he kept this old picture of Ma. This huh. was taken... maybe a year before she died? Before the cancer started turning her into skin and bones? But then she after that. She mostly left us alone, so I had to pretty much raise him. Or at least, I tried. I did the best I could, but... Hell, I was dealing with my own demons. I guess I made a pretty poor substitute for Ma. No, I'm sure you did your best, Maya. Alright, let's go to this bathroom first. And not the door that says do not open. Got a sink. A toilet. Yep, going in here. Oh boy, can't wait to see what happens. <laughs> right, like this is gonna keep me out. You should probably Nick, listen. are you in there? O are you open okay? The door. Open this door! You're going to have I to guess kick I should that door find open. some other way to get it. Or not. How do we open that door? Hello? Uh, hello there? Nick, are you in there? Quit playing. Demon? It's it's me. Your your best friend, please don't kill me. Jeez. Hello? Hello? How did this door open? Well, if we take a look at all these, uh, pictures, I'm not gonna step out of the frame of this door. Yep, he's definitely been There's summoning and interacting with demons. Somewhere. Well, at least I know where all his money's going. But hey. where the hell is he? 
You have a really nice setup, and yet you... Use that camera. Disgusting. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Well... Maybe we shouldn't have powered on this computer. I should check this computer. Maybe it'll give me some clue to what's going on with him. Probably. Boot failure. A USB drive? USB drive? Wait. Let me see if I can find one. That, that's not how computers work. That is not at all how computers work, and that's terrifying. Hmm. Now, where would a USB drive be? Ah, this there it is. This could be it. I don't need to look at anything else in there. Just a random cord. Probably cut it off from something else. Okay. Let's do this. Sandbox OS. Safety, security, anonymity. Did he get stuck in the game? It'd be really bad if he got sucked into a game. Game.exe, play log number one. I finally got it all set up. The Sandbox OS. A secure, heavily modded Linux variant running as a VPC. And the game contained within, this might be overkill. But it's better to be cautious considering the urban legend around the game. Oh, to think it took me nearly six months to track it on the dark web. Let's click the game, I guess. Click to start. Move WSAD. Oh, great. We're gonna get sucked into another game. I did not sign up for this. Especially on the dark web. Don't mess with that stuff. Oh, that's, uh... That's flesh. Great. Well, we can't sprint, so I don't think we're gonna get chased by anything, so... Uh... Gonna... Yep, gonna go in here. I'm not a big fan of whatever that is. Not at all. Sorry, demon, I, I don't speak Latin. The most I can muster is a few words of Japanese. Uh... This way... I, I guess we'll go left. Seems... safe enough, I guess. Should we approach this? Yep. More... Latin, uh, Hey? Hey, is... Is that you, brother? Uh... uh unknown error. Application crashed. Guess we'll go this way. Yeah, I'm honestly kind of glad we can't sprint. I'm not in the mood to have to run away from... Those are some big red eyes. Or torches. What the hell is this? These are all the missing people. Nick! Oh, God. Unknown error. Application crashed. I'm pretty sure that was Nick's photo in there. But that makes no sense. I've got to get this game going again. Uh, if it was me, I would just proceed to ignore this game and, uh, never... <laughs> Go home and... Jeez, ah, that scared me. <laughs> just the lights. The electrics here are falling apart. Like the rest of the building. You wish it was just the electrical. You, like, totally summoned a demon from this game. And you're gonna get sucked into it, lady. Maybe this apartment is, uh... Possessed. Getting worse. Growing signs of malevolence. Waking nightmares. Oppressive thoughts. General malice. 
and an intense craving for self-defilement. Wheeled sounds from the other room, voices, footsteps, shifting sa shadows. An hour ago, the webcam turned on by itself and took a picture. I was able to identify the entity from the symbols in the graffiti. Bail Nagin. Dude, you just summoned Bail. You don't do that. What am I suggest awakening in the dark web? This game is trying to. Yeah. I guess we're going back in. Cause we don't have self-preservation skills. Well, this is a new room. Uh guess we'll go forward. My uh Hi. Hi there, brother. You okay? You possessed by Bale? I'm not a big fan of Bale worship. If I saw one of these idols in real life, I'd uh, set it on fire. Is this the Necronomicon? Oh dear. Not at all what I wanted to do on a lovely Wednesday morning. Actually, is it a Thursday? I don't remember. Days blend together. Okay. Long hallway. Can't wait to get jump scared. It's gonna be great. Hello there. Hi. Hi there. Oh, there it is. Hi there. Another piece of the Necronomicon, I guess. Maybe you shouldn't be trying to summon an eldritch horror to the real world. That never turns out well. Honestly speak. Hello? Good? Can I go forward yet? Maybe? Yep, I can go forward. Hi there. I uh, got your pages to your book. Can I, can I go forward, please? Yes, I can. Alright, another long hallway. Nick? Uh, help me. Please. You have to help me. I don't think that's your brother, Maya. Nick? I'm scared, Maya. That sounds like a demon. It's awful here. Please. Help me. That's not your brother, Maya. He said not to come looking for him. That was Nick's voice. I'm sure of it. I'm, I'm sorry, Maya. Going again. I'm 90% sure that was a demon. Maya. Hello? Is someone there? You, you, you summoned a it's demon. It's too dark in here. I should get the lights on. You summoned a demon. How could the picture have changed How could like the picture this? Have changed like this? I think it's because you're messing with the occult. If there's any advice I could give anyone, don't mess with occult rituals. It, it doesn't go well. Ever. Hello? Nothing's there? <sighs> Nobody. But that's him. <gasps> Nick. But his face. What is happening to me? <sighs> You're, you're delving into an occult ritual that Nick was apparently messing with, and I think it's your fault. Let's go back into the game. Gotta get all four pages. Then we either leave, or we die here. One of the two. Player log number 12. I saw Alex today. He was here, in the apartment. Standing by the far wall. He looked the same as he did when I saw him all those years ago, on a gurney in the morgue the day after the accident. His dead body cold, his face split open, his eyes wide. Despite his horrific wounds and odd angle of his neck, he was somehow still alive. He called out to me. He was grinning, but I saw the hatred in his dead eyes. I survived the accident, even though I was the one drunk and driving. Oh, man. 
He wanted me to follow him. I begged for forgiveness, but I know it's too late for that. There can be no redemption for a man like me. I must go after him. I have no choice. First, I have to call Maya, though. I have to warn her to tell her to stay put and not to come looking for me. Oh, no. <clears throat> she can't save me this time, not from this. And I can't let her get hurt if she comes here. Nick, you are already messed up and she's looking for you. Alright, that must be the third page of whatever accursed book or scroll we're looking for. 304 collected. Wonder what that noise is. It's probably just these gates opening and closing. Oh, yeah. Page number four. Hello there? Uh, you want a hug? Because you can find someone else to do that, not me. I don't, I don't want to hug a demon. I just want to get out of here. And, well, not die. Because that's really bad for your health. Is that a demonic priest? Hi there. You want to get decked in the face? You should, you should punch him in the face, Maya. Oh, all well, things considered. Oh no, an error. Application crashed. What the hell was that? <gasps> Nick, wait! Nick! Uh, can I restart the computer? I gotta go after him. That is not Nick, Maya. Oh well. Guess we gotta- Nick! There's a lot more trash in here than there was. Yeah, we're not in Kansas anymore. This definitely isn't the apartment we entered when we started. Hello? Hi, Nick. Nick! Yeah. You wanna go Nick, home? Nick, stop! It's me! My, you're getting led down a rabbit hole you really don't want to go down. I would much rather go out the exit of this place and never look back. Maybe I can- <gasps> What the hell? <sighs> yeah, I think we're in hell. Oh dear. You should not have played that video game. Power station. The stairs. Looks like we can't go up and we must go deeper. Ain't that swell. Hmm. We can hear footsteps Maya. in the distance. I'm down here. Come quick. Hey. Bail. Uh, you wanna get decked in the face? Cause all this demonic stuff is making me want to deck you in the face. <laughs> anyway. My come on. You're going into I'm the depths of hell. You, you should Maya. not be going down these Where stairs, Maya. We're all waiting. We're all waiting, yeah, that's not terrifying at all. Hello. Hi there. You okay? Nick? The lights are going out as we walk forward. You can't save me, Maya. You never could. Even when we were growing up, you couldn't even protect me from myself. The accident. Alex's death. My miserable life. All of it! That is definitely not different. Nick, that is a demon. If only you'd done what you were supposed to do. Who 
who are you? What have you done to my brother? It's Bale. We are so dead. Dead. Sometime later, I found myself back in the apartment. I couldn't remember how I got there. There was no sign of Nick, or the thing that had looked like him. And his computer would no longer turn on. Huh. I did the only thing I could. I filed a missing person report and flew home. You lost your brother? Oof. It's been six months since then. I've tried every possible way yeah, to Nick locate him. Yeah, totally got stuck inside of that been video no game. From him. That's why you don't go in the dark. I keep web thinking and about the thing the I saw at the bottom of those stairs, the thing from inside the game. When it came at me, just before its awful malevolence could engulf me, something, or someone, stepped between us and shielded me. It was probably Nick who stepped in between you. I think that's how I got away. I think... I think it was Nick who saved me. Gotta love context clues. The end. This was a very interesting game. Very story driven. All things considered, I really enjoyed it. Sadly, there's not a alternate ending or something where we save Nick, but horror games don't necessarily need a happy ending. At least my lived. That being said, if you guys have enjoyed the today's video, that being said, if you guys have enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit the like button, comment, subscribe if you want, and I'll see you in the next one. As always, Goodbye.